Hey guys, my name is Lenny and I'm showcasing my new app I have created for this dating site. Um, this is the app, um, but I'm going to hide it and tell you what I was trying to achieve. Um, this is like a random dating site uh, where you can... Well, this is actually the chat from the dating site and there wasn't any desktop app for it, so I figured I can make one. I cannot connect directly to it, like um, use, well, communicate with their system, so I had to kind of <laughs> work around, make a workaround, and I came up with uh, this app that actually enables me to chat with uh, users from the site. Um, this is like a messenger and the reason is that um, sometimes you don't want people to know what you're doing on your PC and that's exactly the reason why I made this app. Um, it enables me to load all the users. Um, it also displays their status so I can see if they are online or not. I can also see new messages from them. Uh, they would be in brackets with a number of new messages. Um, I can send messages, I can receive messages, uh, I can see pretty much everything that's in the chat here. And yeah, that's basically it. Also, I made my app um, like able to self-restore uh, when it encounters a problem on the site like the site is not responding at the moment or anything happens um, it's able to like pass the exception and retry later also uh, well that, that works for most of the actions um, the only like real problem I have encountered is that it is connected to the um, user interface on the site, so it actually like clicks the user here, and then you have to wait. So it takes a little bit uh, more time, I guess. Well, not really. It takes the same time, uh, but the UI on the website is kind of not really responsive, so it doesn't feel like it's instant. But yeah, the app is really working fast. Only the website is slow. <laughs> Alright, that's probably all I wanted to <laughs> share for now. Um, see you next time.